So I definitely hope that you get a little bit of inspiration from my lookbook and maybe, you know, it gives you ideas or let's just say makes it a little more adventurous once you see my lookbook. But um, yeah, enjoy. Leave me comments and, you know, let me know what you think and if you like it. See you in a bit. My first outfit is a two-piece outfit. The blazer is from Dots, and I actually wore this in my Christmas pictures. And the bottoms are from Macy's. And I just like the length of the bottoms. Like, I just think it makes me, it flatters me just because it makes me look thinner, I think, just taller. And then I know I'm showing a lot of boobage, but I feel it's okay for the New Year's Eve party. And, um, yeah, just really comfortable, chic, but yet fancy at the same time. I feel like a Kardashian sister in this outfit. Really love it. Um, the black and the white paired together, I think it's excellent for the New Year's Eve as well. This outfit is more of a, it's a less dressy outfit, but yet it's still very, like, sparkly, perfect for New Year's Eve. For a party for the club I think it's just more of a preference if you'd rather look more like rocker chic and or you know fancier um, I love the zigzags on this shirt it's oversized so it's not too fitted to your body definitely um, the sequins help hide you know my tummy which I like and then um, just the fact that it's sparkly is another thing that I think makes it perfect for um, a New Year's Eve party or New Year's Eve event. Um, I'm wearing some, and the top is, uh, I think it might be from Kohl's, Macy's, you know what, I don't really remember, but um, the pants are from Target. These are um, patent leather pants. They were um, some collection that they had. It came with a red tag. And then I'm wearing the Madden Girl heels, which are still, you know, they look really cute and stuff, which... I bought them for New Year's Eve, so I'm just pretty much, I think they match with any outfit. I'm wearing my Michael Kors chain bracelet, just something simple, easy, um, just really like it. Um, so yeah, this is one of my favorite looks as well. Actually, I think either L might be one of my favorite looks, just a preference, I think, of what I want to wear. You can't ever go wrong with the little black dress. So this look is my take on the little black dress. Um, this is from Torrid. I think it's a size 2 or 3. Um, it's short, but not too short. I think my favorite thing about my body is definitely my legs. So I'm just, you know, showing them off a bit. I don't know if I would actually wear this outfit just because it's freezing here, but if I was in California, definitely. I'm wearing the same pumps, and then... It's, I'm wearing like a blazer kind of cover up, but it's not as thick as an actual blazer. It's very light, moves really nicely with the dress, I think. And this is from Kohl's. Um, yeah, I love this dress. It's comfy as well. Um, and especially if you're in a club, it gets hot, so this is perfect. And you can take off the blazer and you're ready to party. Woo woo. Okay, this look is a little out there. But I still love it. I think it's something out of the norm. And when I think of going to a New Year's Eve party or a club or something, um, I feel kind of fearless when I go out and stuff like that. Like, I just feel like these people don't know me. And this is something that I love to wear that I normally wouldn't wear to, say, the mall or something. And it definitely gives me a chance to show off an outfit or a piece that I've definitely been wanting to wear. Um, for example, this furry looking vest here, which I actually bought off of a blog um, sale on on YouTube. And I don't know, I just, I love the look. I'm wearing some hot leather shorts with um, studs in them. You can barely see them, they're pretty small. They're from Forever 21. Um, I got them in Chicago. The top is from Lane Bryant, and it is sheer. And I am wearing, and I didn't wear a top underneath. I'm just wearing a really, like, a bra from Victoria's Secret with a design on it or whatever. And you can see through it. Um, and that's another thing. Um, it's New Year's, so I feel like, again, you could be a little more, you know, flaunting your stuff a little, you know. You're parting it up. 
you know, you can look but don't touch, honey, right? So that's definitely, you know, my boobies are out to party as well. Um, my aunt always says, do I look like a bitch? Because I'm, I want to look like a bitch when I go out. And so that's definitely what my uh, plan here was. Um, I'm wearing a studded uh, bracelet that I got off of eBay, just silver, black tights because it's a little cold, and glasses, hello. I'm going to be tea painting it up in the club. So definitely one of my favorite outfits, also very comfortable. Okay, ladies, this is my last outfit. This dress is a dress that I have not shown you at all on a haul or anything just because I wanted this to be my big reveal. This is a dress from Tory Burch. Totally fell in love with it. Completely sequence. Um, it's like a rose gold color with a black sequence. It's a size large in Tory Burch world. So of course they don't have plus size or anything, but you, I love this dress and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try this on. And it looks totally different than what it does on the model. Um, but I put it on and I loved it. I had to do some minor adjustments on the boobage area, but you know what? Um, and there you go, my little boob, boob lift. Um, you know what, it's, don't ever shy away from regular sizes because you don't think somebody's gonna fit. Make it your own. You can rock it. Like, don't let that discourage you. You never know until you try it on. Um, so that's what happened here. And I tried it on and I fucking loved it. So here I am in a size large from regular girl large. Um, the jacket is from Macy's plus size. Um, very comfortable and warm. So it'll be perfect to go out in this weather. And just my black tights. And I'm wearing the same Madden Girl patent leather shoes that I bought from Macy's. Um, I'm, in, I'm freaking in love with this outfit. I think this might be the outfit that I'm going to go with. It's totally out of my norm. I've never worn a dress that's so tight to my body, but I love it. I mean, you can totally see that I have a stomach, but I don't give a fuck. I like how it looks, and that's all that matters, and I'm definitely ready to ring in the new year with this freaking dress. Um, here's to being more adventurous with my wardrobe, and I hope you guys will be as well next year, and, or, you know, if you already are, good for you. Um, just, I added a little clutch to take along with me to put in my, um, cell phone and credit cards and ID, of course, and, um, yeah, just, you know what this dress reminds me of is, it reminds me of the dress that, um, Samantha and Miley Cyrus wear at the same time um, in, I think, it was, was it the second movie or the first? I think it might have been the second movie. And, um, I don't know. It just, yeah. Then here's my dance moves. My dance moves that I plan on doing on the dance floor. Just kidding. <laughs> or am I? But let me know what you guys think of my outfits. Like, seriously, like, do you think I should go with this one? This is personally my favorite, but let me know what you think. Um... Like always, be nice, please. But, yeah, this was my last outfit. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys have an excellent new year and the holidays have been treating you and yours amazing. Um, I want to personally thank you for making this year, I know I've only been here for like since July, but making this an amazing year for me, um, Moving here to Kentucky has certainly been hard, and um, you guys are just kind of like my second family, um, and you've definitely been a great support for me. Someone to talk to through your comments, I definitely feel like I've made some really good friends, um, so thank you. Um, hopefully next year's great for all of us. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys are all safe, have fun, and be careful. Don't drink and drive. Please don't drink and drive. Um, I hope to see you guys next year. Bye.